It's in government. How about put it in right here? Yeah, town hall. Put it in. Yes, this is awesome. We're making quite a bit of money per hour. Yay! We can have race today. All right. So let's try to stick with the Hawaiian theme of Off the Coast. Uh, I'm going to name this. Uh, actually, let's see what suspense. Tan. Tan. Ta. Now. Ia. Uh. How about that? Yeah. Tanta Town Ia. Tanta. Tantau Nauia. Love it. Tantau Nauia. It's going well. Look! Everybody's so happy! In Llama Gas! It's already going up a crap ton with density. We're gonna we're gonna have to start upgrading them pretty soon here. They need work more dirt so cause they needed workers. Whatever! We're gonna upgrade the roads already. Because, you know, people need actual roads. Dirt roads are more just to sketch stuff out. And to actually use for long-term service. Unless if it's used for, like, leading off to random crap. But, for the most part, it's just... No. Here we go! Now we'll get over here! Look at this! We have a functional city now. It's pretty. It's one pretty city. Okay. Let's add in the last one. Boom. Alright. Now they're eventually already going to start asking for medium wealth. Commercial demand is on the complete rise. We should actually probably complete this up with commercial. And then we'll out Oh, they're complaining. Oh, they're not. We have lots of people here, actually. That was really quick. That's so awesome. So, you know what? How about we outstretch this here? Frick. Didn't mean to do that. Don't even know what that was. So, I, I have a feeling this would be really cool if it was like a jigsaw puzzle type of thing. I think that would look awesome. Just in my opinion, that would look amazing. And then we'll, we'll go like, not like that. Come on. There you go. Look at this! Now you know what we can do. Put it to parks. Oh, they don't have power. It's quite depressing. Because we can't really do anything. Okay. So how about we futurize it then? Just futurize our city first. Make everybody happy. The people in the industrial buildings can go outside, probably shoot some hoops or something in the excitatorium. And people are happy now. Power should not be a problem, really. Okay, it's not. They're just complaining. They're complainers. Okay. So now we need... Uh, medium well parks. Like this! AR Athletic Center? AR Athletic Center. Those are our medium wealth. And we'll try to make this as close together as possible. And we'll put in a basketball court here. Okay! 
is beautiful. Love it. And we'll actually also put one here. Look at that. That influenced a lot of areas as well. And then we'll put in a beautiful public tennis court right here. Look at this. Our city's really shaping up. Okay, now we need to add in some more industrial, some more residential. Just zone out this area. And along the lines here, we'll put in some commercial. Fill you in. Here we go. And along here, and that'll be our medium wealth area. Look at this. It's beautiful. We're talking about mega towers. It'll come. It'll come. And how are you doing? It's only 12.1 megawatts, but we'll be perfectly fine. You want a few tries the city. Which we'll just do in our spare time, really. Okay. So here we go. Now we got some medium wealth people. All right. So now it's going to start to become a problem where they're going to ask for stuff such as health care or fire care. So we're going to do that. We're going to support them with fire care. We're going to put it. This will be our area of safety. Safety area. Who doesn't like safety areas? Okay. Safety area. Fire station's out in the corner, so it can also help respond to that and that a bit quicker. We need to put a bell on this baby. And of course, the flag. And now, Tantau Noia is blessed with the fire station. They're happy that we're turning futuristic. They feel safer now that we got a fire station. And they're doing well. They'll be renovating soon. Are you serious? Good! It's commercial, too! Commercial's always useful. Their density is increasing already. We're already getting lots of density com demands to build crap. This AR, it's like, that's an excited for you. It's making some good stuff. What's our industrial doing? Pretty good. Let's look at uh, our tax problems go away. So, their residential is making us the most money with 2,500 bucks. Uh, 891 going to commercial and 774 coming from industrial. Uh, I just saw fire. Oh god, people are dying. Uh, that's not good. Academic attraction. Uh, don't think I'm psychic. I've played this game quite often. So, here, we'll actually up the taxes, and we'll get another $25,000 bond, and we'll get in a clinic, and we'll put in the police station here eventually. Now people are happier, and when people are happier, they increase their density. The courtyard. Do they sell, like, basketball stuff? Oh, no, they sell pets. They sell furry fuzzball animals. Just waiting to be pet in the stomach. Uh, do they sell foxes? Because foxes are awesome. And I'm not quoting the most famous video of 2013. Because 2013 was so 2013. Auto repair. Got nutrient dyeing. Look at all these stores. Look at these roads! They're so high tech. Then they drive like futuristic little Volkswagens. They look they they have solar panels at the top. Who doesn't like driving solar efficient cars? They all look like very power efficient Volkswagens. Like this one. Look. They have just next to each other they have an orange Volkswagen and a pink Volkswagen, and there's a red and a blue Volks power conservative Volkswagens. And apparently, power conservative Volkswagens are the thing here. 
to this. Even the low wealth people can avoid, can afford power conservative Volkswagens, but people are dying there. Look at these guys with like a laser fence. These guys are awesome. These guys are cool. I mean, everybody around the block is wanting, is going to want to come, and they're gonna want to see their laser fence. And it's just such a good laser fence. Look at this. This one has a laser fence, except it has one more corner, just so that they could brag about them. So we have an all-time ri rivalry against the Burns residents and the Ortiz residents. So they have. See, look, these, these crusty, crusty old men, I only have two little poles. Well, these guys got freaking four. One, two, three, four. Yeah, I can count. Look at that. So, fence-wise, these men are better. But then, right across the street from them, they have the Hughes residence. But then they also have the Jimenez residence and the Teller residence. So these two don't, these three don't care. They don't give a crap. They have their fences, and they're just like, oh, we have fences. We have electronic fences that will probably... We can put a cucumber in there, and we'll just zap it in half. Now, because the Burns residents and the Ortiz were just, like, hating each other. And look, over here, the Richardson re residents. Everybody loves to get electronic fences now. They're the thing. Electronic fences. Gotta have them. Everybody is wanting to increase their density quite a bit as well as the industrial uh how's our appro our approval ratings through the roof uh these guys are complaining about health though health is a big issue really freight shipments uh, okay and they got profitable freight shipments okay that's good all right so there's a bit of uh, low wealth commercial demand. We'll just put you here so you can do your thing, chicken wing. And there's quite a bit of medium wealth residential demand. Now what I would quite like to do is expand even more. But before we do that, we're going to increase the density of our roads. So we're going to go for medium density streets. And that is all the talk. So, look, even the rivalry between the Ortiz and uh, whatever their name is. I know one of them's the Ortiz. Or uh, Ortiz and the Burns residents. They don't even care because they're getting new roads. And new roads mean new journeys. And look at this. Roads are just roads. People love the new roads! Can't deny it. Gotta have it. Can't deny it. Roads are the new thing. If you don't have new roads, you're officially a scrub in this town. You have to have new roads. Or else you are just not one of the cool kids. See, look. Even the industrials getting the new roads. I'm like, give me new roads, boy. We want new roads. So we're giving them new roads. And people love them. Now, grandmas can drive across the street and they'll feel even better about themselves because people won't be honking at them anymore. At old ladies anymore. We're not going to do firework fun yet. We're going to expand this though so that we can get up the sexy sign. Uh, the sign says. Well, it actually doesn't have a message. It's kind of just blank and sitting there. But it says it's nice to have a sign for when you're running around in a panic looking for the fire station. And look, they, they just had a fire. So you know what? The sign came in handy, really. So the fire sign only says fire department. Or D-E-P-T. Whichever. Uh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We're full here. We need another patient room... Patients, rooms, wing, wing. Okay, we got one more, and then we'll also put you up, and we'll put you up right here. And sick people don't have time to read the address; they just need to sign, which is perfect, because signs are the new thing. All right, they're on fire. 
they're saving up to buy a bigger house. Those firemen, it's so hot. Because of fire. Yeah. So yeah, firemen are hot. I feel a lot safer now. We got we've had a fire station in town. City of tomorrow. Industrials just hasn't been saying anything. Kind of the quiet ones. This one's just a parking lot or garbage dump or whatever the frick you want to call it. There's crap everywhere. Alright. People want more jobs. I've never had this issue. I have never, ever, 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 ever in this whole entire thing of SimCity have had an unemployment issue. Do we have any homeless people? None that I know of. <clears throat> Look at this. Okay. So now what we're going to do is we are going to do what I was planning to do. And we're going to expand this quite a bit. And we are going to completely make this place high wealth residence. You cannot be the high wealth residence, frick. Here we go. There we go! Now we can get some high wealth people in here. But in order to do that, we need high wealth parks. So what I like to do, so that it's also futurized, we put in the excitatorium. Like here, and here, and here, per se. Alright, crime is starting to become a problem. Whatever, we, we need this first. And, and then we plop down a park like you and we expand it so let's make this fashionable we'll put one here and then we'll take one and we'll put it out here and maybe one more out here as well and frick we'll and then we'll top this all off with one park that shoots up and just taps it all off right here. Look at this. We got a beautiful area of High Wales Parks. And now we can zone in High Wales. And here we go. Now we got some High Wales people that are going to move in. Alright, so there is a mansion coming. I see this the Simpsons residence released to hounds. Not resonance, I'm stupid. Oh! Simpsons. Frick. Go. Uh. Plop. I see the Simpsons reference. I know what the word is, guys. Don't think I'm that mentally retarded yet. I'm not that far gone yet. And look at this. Now we have the petition to build the academy. And we're getting care taking care of waste disposal. This is going to start upgrading sooner or later here, as soon as we plop down a police station, most likely. So it seems as if our first bond is already almost paid off. Uh, we're going to take out one more bond, and we're going to plop down a police station. I think that'll conclude our episodes. Boom. So here we go. Police station's closed, now hiring. And, yeah, they're complaining about garbage. And good. Now we have police station. So people are so happy now that they have crime undercover. They have uh, healthcare over undercover and fire undercover. These guys, he wants an academy. I'll do that. And then, okay. So that'll conclude our series of episodes, I guess. And, of course, in the last episode, I showed you all this new stuff, made a new town. Uh, one question I want to ask you guys, though. Do you want me to keep the old one? Which I know, out of my four subscribers, that's like nothing. Uh, I just want to know if you guys will actually respond on this one. Would you like it if I would keep my old videos on SimCity? Because I'll delete them if I want. If you guys want me to, I will totally do that. 
I'm thinking about it very much so as well. Just to not cause confusion. I think I'll actually just do that. Unless you guys tell me not to. I'll delete them within two weeks. If you guys tell me not to, I will not delete them. Uh, but that's under your own initiative, really. So, last episode... Uh, so yeah, we started the new city. I showed you the city that I really enjoyed making. And all the cool stuff that's in it. And how much money I'm making is an absolute crap ton. And it's just ridiculous. And see, look, we even have Kaimi Omega Co. and Gambling up here under our sleeve. So here we go. We're all ready for the next couple episodes. In this episode, we we helped out around and spruced some things up a bit. We still have the rivalry between the Ortiz and the Burns residents on electronic fences. So you know what? Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed the content and you need a channel, hit that like button and that subscribe button. I would love to see you guys uh, just watching all the videos, really. I mean, you guys have an awesome day, and I will see you guys in another time. Arrivederci.